It costs to eat, you know that? I know that the census was, had that question on it up until 1969 or something about the question. Ask you where the census started. What is the inception of the census? I guess to find out how many citizens are in the states. And the census inception was because the Constitution says that we will divide congressional districts and resources based on the number of people in a particular state and area, legal and illegal, because those people even that are there illegal are in schools, are using hospitals, and funding is determined, and congressional and legislative districts is determined by the number of people that have to be serviced in the district. That is the basis of the lawsuit. Well, so to well, try and do add a question now is against the way the Constitution is written. No, it's time to change the way the, the way the census is and include that question when well, you would so have that to we change can. the Constitution. I got the biggest order. No, you don't have to. You can just add it. They didn't change the Constitution to drop the question. It was on, already on there. And it was removed because it was challenged because it violates the Constitution. If you watch my television show, that was what the Attorney General of New York, who was leading the lawsuit, explained last Sunday and ran it down. That is why they dropped it. It does not follow the main. How do you uh, right therefore, when you live in Orlando, what did if I they tell only you? count the legal, then how do you have enough resources for the schools in Orlando and the hospitals and other things that need public funds that service people that are there legal and easy? How do you do that? You don't do that. That's my point. Well, how do you, then how do you stop that? So if somebody rushes to the hospital, and you're going to ask me to prove citizenship before you serve them they got a bullet wound? No, the emergency situations are... But, but, they, but that's my point. How do you service emergency situations if you're underfunded? It goes by the population. If you leave that question off, you perpetuate and you encourage and you invite all kinds of illegal immigration. You counting those. That doesn't encourage it. First of all, Anyone that's going to fill out a census form is already here. You're not encouraging anything. People that are not here would not have a census form. So that that that, that does not make sense. Well, they won't fill it out. They know the question of citizenship is on there. They won't fill it out. They don't so want to, want to pay to service them. Do you understand? No, we don't take a service. To, no, we don't. You no, just admitted no, yourself that you have to take care of emergency mm-hmm. situations. You just said that that's yourself. A, that's a small percent. That's a small, small How do you percent. know what the percentage is? Oh, my God. You have, God. Some, yes. you have, small. You have some districts where schools and hospitals have a large percentage yeah. of their areas that are to grab being up. illegal. Yeah. 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 They had to meet those areas. Had to oh, oh, they can't oh, service oh, the people that are here meeting. No, no, it's just a, it's just a, a way for California, who has 55 electoral votes, to get 75 oh, electoral votes. And the entire election comes from one state. Well, and that's not what the federal The entire election came from one state, and Donald Trump wouldn't be president. Now, would Come on, at least well, rational. First, you're going to say, let's change the Constitution. Then you're going to say... And under emergency situations, and you still haven't told me how you determine whether somebody put a bullet in them is supposed to stop them. Now you're going to tell doing? me California could determine the election when California went for Hillary Clinton, but Donald Trump was president. You got any more? Uh, if you got any more, uh, if you want to continue this, 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 uh, System where it doesn't where it counts everybody, and the state with the most illegal immigrants wins at the end, and they're all racing to get. They're marching right to the border right now. The state right with the most the border. people should have the most congressional districts and legislative districts, and the most funds to handle people while you debate your immigration policy. But we need to count everybody in a district. Whoever, wherever it is, whether it's in Orlando, whether it's in New York, 
And and so what you're saying is because you're afraid of the politics of it, that therefore people that are here legally ought to suffer in terms of their representation as they're getting goods and services until you can figure out immigration. No, politics is secondary. My primary one that raised the election in California, I think. The, my primary concern is the cost to serve a never-ending march to over the border of this country that is unsustainable. And you seem to think money grows on trees, and we just keep on printing money to feed and care for all these illegal people coming to this country. You lock your doors at the end of the night when you go to bed, and this country should lock its doors and let people in if they got a pass. That's the only way they should get in, and you want to leave the door wide open? Why don't you leave your own home door wide open? And see what happens. First of all, you should relax because you're going to stress yourself out. We <laughs> think that the way you establish <laughs> public funding for our schools and schools, congressional districts and legislative districts, is based on the numbers of people in an area, has absolutely nothing to do with me leaving my door open or leaving the borders open. We're talking about people that are here. You understand that? Only people that are here fill out census reports. Has nothing to do with a door open because the people coming in would not be able to take a census because they are not here. So relax. And next year, when the, and next year, the population doubles and triples. And now you have to the said that y'all close them off the border so they won't be here next year. But what about the people that are here? Your, your, your president... I support. I suppose you support him. Just that he put military at the border, so we won't have that problem next year. But we had a problem next year okay, in the district. I'll tell you what. The Democrats gave Trump that wall. They would even take what question off? The citizens' question. from Russia. We have a lot of immigrants. We don't have as many Mexicans here. So where? What are you talking about? I don't know the source. I don't remember I where you I read it, but I know this. Okay. Thank you, Frank. Let's go to George in Philadelphia. W-U-R-D. You're keeping it real with Al Shopton. Yeah, how you doing? I'm good. <laughs> Things and the way things come about, 